This way, Nathan. I'll be damned. Off to a good start. Yeah, let's just hope the rest of it isn't buried under centuries of dirt and rock. Glass half full, if you please. Sam, up here. I'm coming. Well, no one's home. This place has seen better days, huh? Yeah, the roof could use some work. Sam, this way. <laughs> ah, yeah, that's not happening. Hey, Nathan, I think there's a way through here. Come on, this way. It's a good workout for my quads. Look at this. This is no straw hut. Yep. Some honest to God masonry in here. Where does masons come from? I mean, your average ship might have some good carpenters among them and coopers, but not masons. <laughs> what I wouldn't give for a camel. We have one. Shut your mouth. Are you serious? Yeah. Yeah. It's on the boat with the rest of our stuff. Oh, thanks. Feels good to stretch out again. Yeah, you said it. Hey, there's a way out. Uh, it's too high, even for a boost. Let's, uh, let's find something to stand on. There's a crate. I got an idea. Here we go. Heads up! We're in business. Holy shit. You're gonna want to see this. What do you see? No houses. Wide street. Clearly a commercial district of some kind. Yes, thank you for that, Nathan. Come on. What do you see? You just want to hear me say it, don't you? Really want to hear you say it. All right. Libertalia. <laughs> Libertalia! The long-lost legendary pirate utopia discovered after 300 years by one Samuel Drake. And? And, and his... Younger, slightly less charming brother who happened to be tagging along for the ride. You know, I always knew you'd make something of yourself one day. Yeah, just so you know, it's not my first lost city. You should, you should, you should just enjoy the moment. So where you want to start? How about that building right over there? Oh, you mean the one with the massive guard tower? Yeah. I say we go see what it was guarding. Works for me. This is... I mean... I'm speechless. Holy goddamn shit, Nathan! <laughs> That's your idea of speechless? God, how long do you think it took them to build this place? Years. Decades, even. How the hell did they keep it a secret all the time?
It's just this place. I mean, even without the treasure, this is quite the find. Looks like we found the local watering hole. Pirates will be pirates. <clears throat> Not a bad view. Hey. Cheers. <laughs> yeah, cheers. <laughs> What were they doing here? What were the colonists? Yeah. I mean, you throw your lot in with these infamous outlaws, <laughs> then what? You know, take a load off, yeah. find some refuge, enjoy a little grog. <laughs> it's far worse fates. Yeah, I guess. Except you have to see Avery's statue every day. <laughs> Hey, you, uh, you ever wonder, like, with different choices, how we might have ended up? I mean, like, you taking your magic show on the road? <laughs> no, that was a that was an option. I was good. <laughs> it's not a viable option. What, you know what? You're just jealous. Uh, you always were. <laughs> no, but, I mean, what would our lives have been like if we hadn't started by chasing these... People have been dead for hundreds of years. You think it would resemble more of a normal life? Mm -hmm. Normal. You've got everybody gathered around the table for Thanksgiving, exchanging all the baby photos, something like that. No, no, thank you. Not for me. I like the hand we've been dealt. Yeah, I've heard that before. Come on, we're, we're fortunate, man. <laughs> this is fortunate. Yeah, I mean, of course, I've been locked up for the last 15 years, so it's all relative, I suppose. <laughs> all right, well, I'll give you that. This is much better than prison. My mugs run dry. Yeah, I was about to say, service here is lousy. <sighs> huh. Horse bones. They're still tied up. They were abandoned. Why? Don't know. Maybe people left in a hurry. Or they were taken away. Eh, something isn't kosher here. So what do you think happened here, huh? What do you mean? Well, you know, all good things must come to an end, right? I mean, I joke about cursed pirate treasure, but after hearing all your stories... Well, the simplest explanation is usually the correct one. The, usually. Hey, Sam, check it out. It's like a pirate code of conduct. Hmm. But the whole point of this place was not having rules. Even pirate ships had their own rules.
Captain Avery. I was wondering when you'd turn up. What's this symbol? I saw a few of them when I was coming to find you. Who's marking these places? Is that another sigil? No, not that I know of. Maybe invaders? I mean, I'm sure these guys had plenty of enemies out there. That's a good point. Hey, Nathan, check it out. Oh, I would totally get a picture of myself in this thing. If we had a camera, that is. Well, hey, I can sketch in my journal. Really? Yeah. Guess even a pirate utopia needs a place to lock up riffraff. <laughs> Can you imagine who pirates put in prison? That's a little hypocritical, don't you think? Pirates having a jail? Well, I guess every group has its assholes. Follow me. This is amazing, you know. I suppose we get to that big building with the tower. Hey, Sam, come here. This looks promising. Right by. Looks like a hideout of some kind. Yeah, but who would they be hiding out from? Themselves? Look at this. It looks like the layout of the commercial district. And boom, there's our treasury right there. See, there's the tower. What were these guys up to? There's a symbol again. Yeah. You know, if that symbol was from an invading force, we wouldn't have found it in an underground hideout. Maybe there was trouble in paradise. Secret society or rebels. All definite possibilities. That's our way out of here. I see some light down below. Holy shit. Hey! Uh, I found more of the colony. They've seen us yet. Let's keep it that way. All right, keep your head down. I'm just about to tell you the same thing. 